Manu, let's do it. Uh, let's jump into the first pair of words. All right. The first two words that we will compare are mipta and yalmipta. Mipta, yalmipta. Mm -hmm. So you know what mipta means, right? Yeah, I think yalmipta is even stronger. Oh, Maybe well, it could, could be, yeah. <laughs> yalmipta. Uh, so what okay. is mipta? Mipta is um, to hate someone or to dislike. Yeah, so you say miwo or miwo yo. Miwo. It, it is a irregular conjugation verb. So uh, you say mi, not, instead of mi po yo, you say mi wo yo. Mi wo yo. So when you say uh, oppa miwo, it's like, you know, oppa miwo. my sisters used to say that to me too. <laughs> Whenever, <laughs> you know, I was just fooling oppa around with them. Miwo. <laughs> so miwo is something that you can say to somebody who you do not really like mm. for a certain behavior or for the person's existence itself. Yeah. So, um, yeah, mi miwa. Da is to hate. So it's the opposite of chota. Yeah, but you can only use it uh, about a person. You can't say, you can't miwa a book. Mm. You can't miwa a, a place, right? Uh -huh. So in that case, you would but say... But you can say, like, mm. uh, a drawing is ugly. Ah. You say mipta, <laughs> or is it the same? Is it the same verb? Or so mipta can be ugly too. I can mean yeah. ugly as yeah, well. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So ikurim mipta. Yeah, it's ugly. It's, this drawing so is ugly. It is a different meaning in that case. It's, it's a different meaning. Yeah, right? it's different not definition. It's not likable, I guess. Okay. So mipta is to hate, um, or to feel some hateful feeling mm -hmm. towards something. But yal mipta is slightly different. Yal mipta. Yal mipta is like you could. You could be nice to the person, mm -hmm. but you're you're mean to the person. Yalmita, you do it on purpose. Ah, uh, yeah. So, so is that correct? What you're saying is, when you say yalmita about someone, mm -hmm. that person is mean, or you are mean. Yalmita, that person is mean. <laughs> yes, yes. So yeah. that person is mean. So yalmita. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that person is mean, and you feel that that person is yalmita. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um. So I can say, um, <laughs> 그 사람 행동이 yeah. 얄밉다. Yeah. That person's that's, actions. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I don't like that person's actions. So or, that's that's a good usage. But okay. if you put it in English, it can be a little trickier because 얄밉다 means sneaky, mm -hmm. cunning, um, and also you want to hate this person, but you can't really hate him or her. So. Uh, a child, think of a child. Yeah. He's too smart for you or too smart for his mm -hmm. own good. He would uh, find a way to sneak into, I guess, a cupboard and takes out all the candies and <laughs> stuff like that. You you don't really hate the child. Mm -hmm. He's just, ah, I, I want to punish him for doing that. Mm -hmm. But he's a kid, he's cute still. Yalmiwa. That's yalmiwa. Okay. Yeah. So, yeah, that, that's the difference. You, you do not exactly hate mm -hmm. someone in that case. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, so it's not as bad, let's Not say. as bad. So you said earlier that almipta feels stronger. For so me, depending on the situation, but I thought initially when you asked me, I was like, almipta is like, mm -hmm. it's a bit stronger because you're kind of like doing it on purpose. So you're kind of being mm -hmm. on the evil side. Yeah. So, but, <laughs> yeah. Anyway, uh, that's the difference, everybody. Mipta, yal mipta. Mm -hmm. uh, if you also have words that you don't understand mm -hmm. or you can't really differentiate, then we can help you send them in. Okay.